Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. Today, I am going to show you how to repeat this Boris Tails. I've had this succulent for more than a year. It was very small when I just got it. One of the reasons why I want to repeat my Boris tail is because it's getting so crowded in this pot. Plus, I think it deserves a nicer pot. Some people recommend using succulent soil for repotting. But, since I already have potting mix here, then I'm just gonna use this and I promise to update you with how the succulent adjusts to its new home. For repotting, I normally like to put cross eggshells on the bottom of the pot. This is why I never threw my eggshells. Trust me, this have been a big help for all my big plants. Originally, this bar's tail was in this black pot with three orchids and with two other kinds of little plants for decorations. It was so beautiful, but soon after the orchids lost its flowers, the other plants did so too. My employer decided to give it to me, and later on, I decided to repot the three orchids, and that is why the bar's tail ended up in this white empty pot. There's the good and bad news when it comes to repotting this plant. The leaves are so fragile and they could easily pop off if you accidentally bump one of them. But the good news is that the leaves that are fully out will become a new plant. So try to be very careful when repotting and don't worry too much if some of them come off. You are probably wondering why I'm wearing my winter outfit around springtime. That is because it is 50 degrees right now, plus it is windy, and I'm telling you, my limbs are starting to numb because of the coldness. Repotting is not that hard though, but sometimes it depends for what it looks like or the condition of the bar's tail. Here's an example of some of those leaves that are fully out. Instead of throwing them out, I'm going to plant this one by one around the pad so they can root faster and propagate. It is okay to just drop them wherever on the soil, but I'm just being extra careful. Finally, I'm finished with my repotting. And now I am going to put this pad in my living room in front of the bay windows where there is so much sunshine here in the morning. And I can't wait for all the baby boris tails to grow and fill up the whole pad. This plant can grow up to 4 inches long and maybe that is the reason why it is called boro or donkey's tail. Or if you want to be scientific, sedumorganemium. Ugh, it's so hard to pronounce. I think I just had a new idea for my DIY YouTube channel for the future and that is about cleaning my windows and at the same time I could show you how I wash my employer's windows with my consideration. I have three windows here, one in my dining room and two in my living room. I am planning to wash my windows around June and why is that? Because right now flowers are blooming and that means pollens are everywhere. Let me show you guys our Eastern Red Bud Tree just bloom. And look, even my garden croton plant, flowers are starting to bloom. Spring is one of my favorite season. Lots of rain, lots of flowers are blooming. Birds are so happy and you can hear them chirping for almost the whole day. Thank you everyone for watching my video. Please don't forget to subscribe at pakitansap na rin po. At mas maganda sana kung pipindutin mo rin yung bell button para ma-update kayo sa mga latest video ko. Maraming salamat po sa lahat. God bless your heart. And happy Easter everyone!